Hey guys and welcome to another episode. Fair value gaps considered interesting areas to execute trading opportunities. But you know why some fair value gaps were perfectly fine while other ignored by the market? To answer this question, we back tested fair value gaps thousands of times under different conditions. To find out the characteristics of high quality fair value gaps that are being respected by market. I am personally using fair value gap in my strategy and it is giving me very good results. I also watch some strategies on YouTube using fair value gaps and backtest all the strategies and applied multiple rules to see if they really increase the win rate of fair value gaps and gather some of the most interesting results. We concluded that fair value gaps work under certain conditions when some repetitive patterns happen in the market. So in this video, we will explain the basic rules and simple setup for trading fair value gaps. We will show you the backtesting results. Second, we will describe the conditions required for high probability fair value gap and how to increase the win rate. So guys, if that's something you are interested in, please like this video and subscribe my channel. So first, let me explain some of the primary rules about fair value gap in the smart money concept. Here is an example of fair value gap or imbalance zone in bullish side. The non-mitigated area in a move is called fair value gap. You can see that this is the area where no selling take place. And the wick of third candle is not touching the wick of first candle. This is second example of fair value gap in buy side. In this example, you can also see that the wick of third candle is not touching the wick of first candle. This is the example of fair value gap in sell side. In this move, this is the area where not buying taking place. These are some more examples of fair value gaps. Now we are going to learn that how we can take trades using fair value gaps. As we know that market always come back to fulfill these imbalance zones. But we can't trade this zone blindly. We need some set of rules. We need 100% proof successful rules to take trades in fair value gaps. So rule number one is the move should create imbalance zone. Imbalance occur when we have drastic moves that create gaps between shadows. These are examples of imbalance and balance move. Second, it must lead to break of structure or a change of character. A change of character or a break of structure is the first clue that the market is telling us whether it will tend to continue in the same direction or reverse. Third, it must be unmitigated. Fair value gaps are one time use. So we are looking for trading opportunities when the first time price taps into fair value gaps. Fourth, it should be first fair value gap in a move. One move can create multiple fair value gaps. So we'll use only first fair value gap or you can also say that lowest in a buy move and high fair value gap in sell move. Fifth, after finding fair value gaps, we will highlight order blocks. The range of first candle of fair value gap is called order block. These are examples of order block. This is imbalance zone. So this would be our order block. Now let me explain the steps of strategy we are going to use in order to utilize these fair value gaps in an efficient way. The rules of this trading strategy are very easy. Find any support or resistance zone in 4H time frame. Open 15 minute time frame chart. Find a move with breaking structure. Find fair value gap in this move. Identify order block zone. Place order at the beginning of the zone and put your stop loss 2 to 3 pips below this zone. We target 4 times of our stop loss length. 
this way even with 20% win rate we will still at break even i have back tested this setup thousands of times because i am personally using this same strategy these are some latest trade example using this strategy this is euro aud trade example on 48 time frame market is at support and in 15 minutes time frame at this point market is changing character so this is our fair value gap this is our order block and this is our winning trade this is gold trade example on 48 time frame market is at resistance zone on 15 minutes time frame here market is breaking structure or changing its character this is our fair value gap this is our order block zone and this is our winning trade this is another example of trade on AUD JPY this is euro GBP trade example this is 4H resistance zone this is 15 minute structure shift this is fair value gap and order block so in this way you can take trades according to my statistic this strategy has 45% win rate although these results can vary person to person because of broker spread and other market condition to follow this strategy you need lewis spread broker i put link some of the best lewis spread brokers in description so now let me explain required condition to identify a high quality fair value gap and order block because we are entering in 15 minutes time frame so you need low spread to get proper risk reward ratio if after breaking structure market break again its next structure without fulfilling its fair value gap then we will avoid this type of entry in a scenario like this you can see that market is breaking its structure but also formed a structure within a structure so in these types of setup we'll use this order block to take trades so guys i hope you understand that how you can use fair value gap properly to take best results please like this video and subscribe my channel